So here's a bunch of resources for you, for those of you that like to be nerdy like me. So I wanted just to connect back to our top five. And I started with the pedagogy, but today I got into the why behind the pedagogy. Um, and thank you for trusting me in the journey, but now I'm gonna give you why did we pick these top five, right? So clearly correct pronunciation is gonna be critical because everything is rooted in phonemes and phonology, right? The sequence matters. And that hear, see, say, write routine, which I know some of you are, are rap, really working with your teams on that because that's gonna help with the decoding skill, but it's also gonna help them orthographically map. The routines do the same thing. And then this interaction and high quality practice will lead to the inter, um, orthographic mapping. And then small group instruction. So we're diagnosing you know, exactly what students are not it can do and are not able to do so that we can address that. So just kind of in summary, um, word bubble reading is phonological. It doesn't make sense, but that is how it works. And visual memory is not, does not really help us. Okay, so we wanna to work towards orthographic mapping. It will then appear to be visual memory, but it's not really. We wanna make sure that we work on Decoding, but the orthographic mapping, both are critical and both are rooted in phonemic awareness and phonology, right? Um, fluency will come with that, but the more that we develop these things and we can prevent the reading, okay? And so the most important things we need to do is advance phonemic awareness. Don't just do the basic stuff. And some of that doesn't show up until first grade. Right, And by the end of first grade, a lot of people leave that out. But the advanced phonemic awareness skills are truly where that portion of the brain is developed. So that's like phoneme replacement, phoneme manipulation, moving things around, right? Change the first sound to the end sound, flip them around, right? All that stuff. The kids need that advanced stuff and they need all the phonemic awareness skills. That is why wonders um, um, circles through them. Every day there's another skill that they're revisiting. They have to have that letter sound correspondence and they need lots of opportunities to map this and own it. And so that is um, basically the, a, a quick summary of the science of reading. <laughs>